Hey, it's Eric here. Welcome back to the channel. Today we're doing a video about the Great Sea Ray. Uh, this mount is uh, it's pretty easy to fish up, honestly. It's uh, about a 10% drop rate. It's a 1 in 500. Um, it doesn't mean you'll exactly get it in uh, 500 uh, consecutive fishing, but you gotta fish from the pools. Um, it's a pretty, I want to say it's a pretty easy amount to get. Um, I've gotten two so far. I've sold one on the auction house for 70k. You'll get some, uh, you'll get a lot of fishing mats for uh, like making a big sea like uh, meal, especially if you're raiding. Those tend to sell pretty well. A lot of, a lot of the fish sell for at least eight gold or more. And a 200 stack, you can get yourself a couple thousand gold doing this as well. It's not the best gold farming thing in the world, but if you do get the rate to drop, I mean, you, you can get at least a couple hundred K. I can see myself farming this um, more to try to work towards the uh, 5 million gold to get that mount. Um, also, there's a couple things you want to make this easier, or one thing to make it easier. Uh, actually, there's a couple things. You want um, maybe some fishing gear uh, to help increase your fishing. I don't know if that will help, but I feel like it helps me out. Also, it gets you more fish instead of trash. Um, I, uh, I wear the little fishing hat. I don't have the good fishing poles because I, I haven't really gotten into fishing that much. But I, I think all that stuff you can get would probably help out a lot. Uh, big fishing um, bobbles because for me, I like to watch Netflix while I do these farm guides. And it makes it easier to notice when the thing bounces. or Because I can sell the volume on for fishing, but you can't really hear that, that easily. Um, water strider mount will help out a lot, especially in the zones um, you're going to want to be going through. The zones that I like to fish in are... Um, on Zandalar, uh, along this coast, I'm going to put, put a picture up of uh, some arrows pointing to it for both of them, and in Voldoon. Uh, because the coast seems to be pretty unbroken for most places, it's pretty easy to run along. There's a lot of grouped uh, fishing spots. Uh, one place I do not recommend going to is Nazmir. Nazmir was pretty horrible to fish in. Uh, there's a lot of spots where the fishing pools are actually either bugged or something like that, or glitched out, because they're too far off the... Uh, too far off the um, the uh, beach to fish. That's why, and another thing that actually would be good, I've seen people fishing with, I don't have it, I need to go farm it, is there's a, a little like fishing boat you can get from uh, some World Quest, or not some World Quest, some of like my dailies in Pandaria, and you can ride that around on top of the water and fish. It's a lot easier to fish on that than that. So that would, if you do have that, Nazmir would be a good place to fish then. There was just like, like five pools I came across that I could not fish. And it was really annoying, and it made me want to leave, leave Nazmir immediately. And so I went up to Voldoo and the fish. Uh, I do play Horde side uh, mostly. I am leveling Alliance Tune so that we can um, do more guides on the Alliance side a lot easier, giving a better perspective of spots you can farm from that won't be contested of Horde players all the time. Um, and I wouldn't farm in War Mode unless you really want to, because um, you'll probably be interrupted, interrupted a lot, especially in some spots for like farming. Like when I did the, uh, the Vainsinger video, that's that spot was definitely a uh, a horde spot, a very very uh, hot spot for horde players. So if you're an alliance player trying to farm there, it's gonna be hell unless you're doing it in um, out of War Mode. All right, guys, I think that summarizes everything. Thanks for watching. I am trying to keep these very short and quick to the point so you guys get all the information you need to do the fishing uh if you enjoyed the video please like subscribe and hit that bell button i'll have more to come i also make machinimas they're a little bit slower going i'll probably have one month or two a month if i if i can put it out but right now i have a bit of writer's block on the current one i'm working on i'm trying to do bigger and better projects because i've been learning a lot from part of the community and thank you for watching guys take care goodbye